I feel like I've been reading a lot about how you're supposed to make your bed in the morning. This is a thing, like, I'm not even kidding you, I've read like 15 things on Twitter this week. Okay, not 15. At least two this week so far, where it's like, you should make your bed. And I feel like it's my mom, like, going in and like, messing with my Twitter things and like sending me these things to see because like where else would that come from? That's only a thing your mom says, but it does, it does look a lot better. What do you think, Mies? Did I do a good job? I mean, I make my bed pretty frequently. It's just a rarity for me to put all the cute pillows on it. And the pillows are so dang cute. That's kind of the whole thing that makes it. I guess it is a good start to the day, right? I mean, I feel great. <laughs> Do you wanna go outside? Let's go for a walk. All right, you ready? <laughs> Good morning, Mr. King are on our walk. Hey, what's up, hello? I can't get that song out of my head. I was on Pinterest yesterday and I saw like a front doormat that said that on it and I was like, oh, that's really cute. We need a new one. Maybe I'll like check and see how much it is. And I looked and I'm like, it's $42. Do I really need a Fetty Wap like floor mat, <laughs> like probably not. I didn't order it. I feel like I should though, because it really made me happy. I feel like if every day I walked out of the door and I saw like Fetty Wap lyrics, I'd be like, oh, this is gonna be a good day. Ah, anyways, I'm feeling super goofy today. It feels like it's gonna be a great day. I'm super stoked because I'm working only like half the day and then I get to go get my hair did because my roots are kind of out of control and I haven't had a haircut in like, at least six months because of cheerleading. <laughs> it's always like, you want your length, you need to keep your length. And I'm like, uh, just please, <laughs> it's bad. <laughs> the most important thing though, for right now, beyond a Fetty Wap uh, floor mat, or what is that called when you have a front door mat? Have you all seen those on Pinterest? And they're like super cute. Welcome mat. Why can't I think of what that's called? Because I haven't had any coffee, that's why. If y'all are up for it, and you feel like adventuring away from YouTube, you should go check out lindsaybrooksbell.com. I posted a pretty silly playlist yesterday. Um, it's New Music Monday, number 21. It's my 21st playlist that I posted. I started posting all the Spotify playlists, so you can go and like follow them if you want to, if you have Spotify. So the playlist is all the music that I listened to while I was running the half marathon that gave me motivation to finish. And I might have overreacted because I said that playlist is the only thing that kept me from not dying. But um, I mean, there are other things like my legs, but mostly it was that playlist. <laughs> so go check it out if you're feeling frisky. All right, we're going to work. You ready, Mies? I'm feeling pretty amazing today, and I was trying to get to the bottom of why I would be feeling so awesome. And I think number one is because I'm going to get my hair done, because that's always awesome. It's just nice to be girly and get pampered. But number two, I think, is this absolutely insane, amazing weather we're having right now. It's in the 70s. It's just gorgeous out. And then I looked at the forecast for the whole week. It's in the 70s all week. It's like 76 on Saturday, and I'm like, huh beach day. So we're totally having a beach weekend. First things first, hair done. I just feel so great. I love it. I love waking up when you feel like a million bucks. All right. I'm going to feel more like 1.4 million bucks as soon as I'm a little blonder. <laughs> so I kind of love it. It's a little more sandy blonde, but I feel like it looks really good and it's kind of just a good little midway for right now. It's always nice to have a little beauty overhaul, a little beauty day. Now I'm on my way to Pure Bar because I'm gonna make it in time because I wanna go take a Pure Bar class because I haven't in a couple days and I miss it. Come on, traffic. Be in my favor, please. Here to ride this train, make a few marks, leave a few stains. Who am I right now? <laughs> I have lost my mind. <laughs> I've pretty much been a rocker girl my entire life. Um, I was a huge fan of emo music growing up and brand new is like my favorite band ever. But there's something about country music, like I've always liked it, usually after I've had like a couple cocktails and I'm listening and I'm like, this is so emotional, like this is giving me all the feels. But now, I mean, now that I date a country boy, I feel like I listen to it so much more. And I like it, and I hate to admit that. My whole life I was like, I hate country music. Well, look at me now, never say you hate stuff to anyone because you're gonna grow up and have to change your mind and be like, sorry guys, <laughs> all those 
25 years of my life where I said I hated it, and well, now I feel differently. <laughs> oh, whoops. All right, I'm going into work. <laughs> so, I'm super stoked. Check out my new Willy Wonka sunglasses. Mostly because of the shape, but also because look what they do. They're green, and then they're purple, and then they're green, and then they're purple. How cool is that? Like, if I were gonna create sunglasses, they would do something cool like that, I feel like. So, hooray for new sunnies. I'm super excited about how my day went. <laughs> new sunglasses, got a lot of work done, and now I'm going, I don't know if you guys know this, but I've been getting um, my eyelash extensions done because I had to put so many um, fake eyelashes on for cheerleading and stuff. We have to wear them for a lot of events. So I was like putting them on for all of these things. And I live so far away and like I have a two hour drive time to get to Tampa. So I feel like I was like anything I can do to take some time out of my life. And then I found this awesome girl who does it out of her house and she just had a baby and you know, I'm helping support her family and I feel really great about that. So I gotta go get these updated. They're looking a little, my shag's looking a little rough right now. <laughs> a little rough along the edges, so we're gonna get them fixed. New sunnies, new lashes, new hair. It's just that kind of week, y'all. Mm, it's like a Beyonce. I don't, even, I don't even know. I'm making myself nauseous, we gotta go. <laughs> Another day down. I'm getting actually really nervous because we have tryouts again. Uh, for cheerleading coming up. I'm really excited though because for the whole month of March, every Tuesday we have audition classes that we can go take um, in preparation for the big auditions in April. And it's really cool. If you like dancing or if you ever thought, hey, maybe I might want to try out for a cheerleading team, I think you should come take classes if you're in Tampa. It'd be really fun. Um, it's going to be Tuesday nights and it's online. I'll put the link down in the description if you wanna go check it out. But come take some dance classes, come try it out. I know I've had some people on Twitter kinda of ask me like what I would do again or could I help them um, get ready for tryouts and I can't really because honestly, I'm only 50-50 for making the team right now. There's one year that I didn't make it and then one year that I did. So I think as long as I'm actually on the team, um, I kind of have to stay just concentrating on what I'm gonna do and how I can be a part of it. But I definitely think if you've ever thought about it or you think you might want to, you should come to the tryout practices and check it out because Coach Chair I'll talk a lot about what you need and what you can work on and um, kind of the technique and the lifestyle that you need to have to be able to make it. So it's a really good place to learn and if you just like dancing and want to come take classes, that's fun too. I know that's one of my favorite parts. So it's kind of nice because it's competitive but at the same time it's, a, it's really, really fun to just go take dance classes. What is my dog doing right now? <laughs> Hi, Hamiz. What are you doing, you goof? What you doing? Do you want to go outside? Do you want to play dog stuff? Do you hate the squirrels? <laughs> All right, so now that I got new hair, I got new lashes, and I got my pup to hang out with, um, I think I'm gonna head to bed. I love you guys. Thank you so much for being so awesome. I will see you on Sunday. We're having a beach day on Saturday for sure. Bathing suits and bikinis and party times to be had. There's a random clip at the end. All right, love you guys. See you later. Bye. Miss Coco Racha, Miss Coco Racha, Miss 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 Coco Racha, Miss Coco Racha, Miss 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 Miss